This quirky project caught my eye and I just had to try it. Making a spiral cut file is easy to learn and easy to make. All you need is a cutting machine, a heat source, some heat transfer vinyl, and a t-shirt, tote, or other blank to apply your design to. You will also need a JPEG or PNG file with a photo or design. First go to SpiralBetty.com. The process is free, but I recommend you make a donation. Click on Upload Image and choose the picture or design you would like to use. Then click Open. Your picture will appear in the circle. Use the slider to resize, then click the check mark. Across the bottom of your screen, there are a number of colors. Since we are cutting this design, select the black and white option. Next, move the slider about three quarters of the way to the right. Click the arrow button, then select download. This is where you open your cutting software. I will be using Design Space. Open a new project and upload the image you made in Spiral Betty. You can see my blog post to learn how to upload an image. Select Complex Image and then Continue. When the Select and Erase screen appears, click on the blank space of your design to remove the background. Then select Continue. Next, choose Cut Image, then Upload. Finally, select your upload and then Insert. Finally, when your file opens in your new project, resize your design to anything less than 11 and a half inches. Then click Make It. It takes your machine about 10 to 15 minutes to cut the spiral. It is crazy to watch it go round and round. Once cut, find the outside end of the spiral and start to pull. You simply weed by pulling this thread around and around the spiral. Slowly but surely, you will see your design begin to emerge. Remove the outside edge and you are ready to iron on your design. Place your weeded design face down on your t-shirt or other blank. Heat press your design, then slowly peel away your carrier sheet. And congratulations, you have created your first spiral cut. Try another photo. Use a PNG design. Anything you like to create something fun, funky, and new. Thanks for joining me at Comfort and Crafts.